name is James Bellissimo. Um, as of Labor Day week, I am the new town manager of Berwick. For those who don't know me well, I've pretty much either worked in Berwick or lived in Berwick or volunteered in Berwick my entire life. My family moved here in the 1950s. Um, I was extremely fortunate to be part of the downtown vision committee and as part of that process, uh, in imagining what the downtown could be. And over time, uh, the Downtown Vision Committee evolved into Envision Berwick, implementing the plan. And over that time, I went from a volunteer, not really knowing how to get ideas done, to becoming the chair of Envision Berwick. And it was my, it was my job to cross off the goals of the Downtown Vision Plan. And over time, um, I, I had my foot in the door, obviously, as uh, a volunteer. Uh, I saw an opportunity to become a water secretary or planning secretary and ended up getting that job and then ended up becoming an assistant planner and then director of planning. And here I am today. It's an honor and, and, a, and a privilege to be in the spot and I, I look forward to working with everybody. Um, another piece, uh, I have an undergrad in business administration from University of Southern Maine and I have a graduate degree from the Muskie School of Public Service in public policy, planning and management. So for this next year, it's all about taking the baton from Steve. As he's, he's handing it off to me, I just wanna make sure I grab that and, and keep going at the pace that we've been going. We have all kinds of fun and, and impactful projects. Uh, the, we're gonna work on the water improvements. We're working with Jody, our director of public works and our consultant uh, to look at the water plant and to look at the, the process. And we have funding from the bond and we have some federal funding that's also coming in so it's going to be fun to pull together those resources to come up with a permanent solution to manganese once and for all one of my other first tasks is to work with the select board to come up with priorities and strategies and goals so that'll be fun to work on short-term goals and goals over the next three years or so uh, over the next few weeks here, I'm going to be reaching out to department heads and meeting them one-on-one -on -one in my new role and establishing a new relationship in my new role. Um, and I look forward to, do, to, doing, to doing that. And for the more mid to long range, I mean, I've been thinking about long range goals for Berwick for a long time. So um, it'll be really fun to start thinking about the more long-term goals and where we want to be 10 to 15 years down the line. Um, another fun thing that's going to be in the short term is finding my replacement. That means finding a new planner. And, and the key is we have such great department heads and such great uh, chemistry right now and teamwork uh, to find a planner and to find someone that, that fits in with the team. Uh, it's, it's going to be a fun pro process. Uh, other projects, uh, capital projects, um, we have some public works and um, town hall needs some improvements and memorial fields, uh, the feasibility study. Those are some big uh, ticket items. <laughs> so in the short term, with uh, who's going to fill my seat, uh, we're going to have Lee J. Feldman from SMPDC, Southern Maine Planning Development Commission. And he'll be in. He's very familiar with the town and he'll be our director of planning. And hopefully um, the thought right now is to hire a young planner that can grow into the role much like I did, get somebody in here that's uh, fresh from their bachelor's degree or graduate degree, someone that can come in as a planning assistant and work their way up to become the director of planning. In terms of my, the open door policy, that's gonna stay the same. Uh, my door will be open. I might have both of my doors open. The phone number is the same, uh, extension 111, town manager at Um I will get back to you. I, I, I definitely will try to get back to you as soon as I can. Um, I will encourage you to visit the town website at I want to contact the town employee. If you can contact the department where if you have a department related question, that'd be great if you contact them. But if not, I'm happy to talk with you. I'm sure I've talked with a lot of you out there for planning related matters. So uh, again, my, my extension is 111. Um, 
And in terms of, like, like I mentioned before, our department heads are fantastic. We get along great. Uh, we've, we've, we've come a long way in terms of building relationships together and working collaboratively. And I don't want to, I don't want any of that to change. Um, we might, as the budget season comes in this winter, I'll have a better idea of what staffing needs are. But in terms of department heads, I think it's, it's, it's important to keep where we're at. And lastly, as long as COVID's here, we're going to be following CDC recommendations and guidelines. And for my friends who aren't happy to hear that, and I know we've heard this for a long time, just please be patient. And we, know, we don't know what's for certain for fall and winter, but at some point we'll be behind this. And it's all about reducing the probabilities of getting our people sick and our staff sick. So please just come in, wear a mask. We have a good setup for social distancing. And again, just all I ask is please be patient, work with us, and we'll get through this thing. Uh, the town has an incredibly bright future ahead of us. We've got the edge. We've got really exciting capital projects. Uh, I'm looking forward to working with all the volunteers, all the boards, all the staff. Uh, anyone that wants to reach out, uh, there's definitely a role for you to participate in, in Berwick's future. So thank you everyone for the opportunity. And, uh, and I'm, again, it's a privilege and honor to be your town manager. So, thank you.